My name is Michelle Dupre. I'm the Integrated Healthcare Director at Starfish Family Services, and um, I run a department that has a number of initiatives related to integrated healthcare. So we know children eventually become adults, and children with undetected physical and mental health needs uh, will eventually become adults with more expensive and more extensive physical health and mental health needs. And our current system is actually continuing that um, as a problem in our country because of all the silos that exist between physical health care and mental health care. I guess one thing I would say is that uh, about having a behavioral health specialist in the office is that uh, as you look over your schedule when you come in in the morning and you see that question behavior problems, you don't immediately go, oh, I don't want to have to deal with this. And you're able to at least go in talk with the parent and then say, these are my ideas, but I want you to talk with a behavioral health specialist and, so that we can delve further in, into this issue. So my name is Deborah Lee. I'm a behavioral health consultant with Starfish Family Services. I'm basically tasked with two things. One is actually working within the clinic setting to help integrate the practice. Uh, the second is actually fulfilling the role as a behavioral health consultant myself. So that's direct patient family care. Anything and everything that we can do in the office is great for the families, it's great for the kiddos, and um, easier for us as well just to kind of keep everything under one roof. We have, you know, better notes, better communication. Obviously, you know, you and I chat about the kids and, and their care. So, um, yeah, that's how I would explain it. Just kind of health care from every aspect, all under one roof, or at least we try as best we can. A huge benefit, I think, for us because we are such a busy practice is just time savings. So having a behavioral health specialist here in the office is beneficial because it saves the providers a lot of time. We're in the room going through our care and we know that they are, they're having some issues socially, you know, mentally, emotionally. Um, we're able to simply leave a room and come and grab, you know, one of our behavioral health specialists. So that is a fantastic benefit. Mm -hmm. Saves us a lot of time and much easier for the parent and the patient as well because they're already here. No need to set up another appointment at the time. And especially with teenagers, it's difficult to get them to even come in again. So the fact that you're here and you can see them and connect with them at that initial visit is a huge benefit. So if a doctor you know, is meeting with a patient for 15 to 20 minutes, I'm replicating that model where I'm gonna meet with a patient for 15 to 20 minutes. And in that 15 to 20 minute session, you know, I'm doing a very targeted assessment um, and doing a very brief and focused intervention just to make sure that the patient is able to get through day to day. But after every patient interaction, you know, I'll go back to the doctor and do a really brief consult um, with the doctor as far as what we determined and what the plan of care is at that point. Just the communication between the providers and behavioral health specialists is a big deal as well. In the past, we'd have to send our kiddos out for counseling and it would take forever to get consult notes back, recommendations, you know, plan of care if at all. So it's great to have almost instant notes in the chart um, and be able to communicate at any time. Yeah, I feel that patients really enjoyed being able to delve further into some of these issues knowing that you know, most of the time the pediatrician where we're looking at all the physical things and getting the shots done and all of that, you know, maybe spend a couple minutes on their behavioral issue, but it was a way of them being able to talk further about this issue without having to go to another office. I think a lot of the folks would just say, well, it's something that's on my mind, but do I really want to schedule another appointment to talk about this? No, not really. But uh, having a behavioral health specialist in the office, they will go ahead and deal with it. And we got a lot of positive feedback about that. A lot of times doctors are tasked with providing a lot of information to patients, but one way that a behavioral health consultant can help is we can some absorb some of those tasks. So that might look like providing anticipatory guidance for typical child development issues, providing psychoeducation materials, um, doing a lot of normalizing and validating for any of the parental concerns that might arise. One of the other benefits, I believe, was that it introduced the topic of, of mental health uh, specialists to some people. I think a lot of people viewed that as something, uh, I'm not crazy, I don't need to see that person. And it was sort of like a bridge going from the pediatrician to the behavioral health specialist in the office to seeing a behavioral health specialist at another center. So it kind of provided a, con a continuity 
I've been to other um, clinics and stuff, and I never, well, they never noticed or seemed to really pay attention to my emotional needs. And come here, everyone saw it, and they recommended me to somebody. And it was like, it wasn't a disrespectful recommend either. It was like, this is going to help you. This is, you need this. Because I didn't think to come to a mental health center due to what I had to come here for. If I wasn't recommended, I probably wouldn't have came myself. So I think some other people just need the push. I think it eases my mind when I have somebody that I'm very concerned about, whether they're depressed or whether they may uh, be a suicidal, to have a behavioral health specialist right here in the office rather than having to trust them to go out and, and maybe either not make the call or uh, get a busy signal or have any other frustrations and have the child's needs maybe not being met. The other thing that was very, very helpful to us is that different agencies, um, different uh, information, um, they change a lot, different websites. And so we may be giving somebody a very nice informational website that no longer is updated or no longer is there. We may be giving them a phone number that is no longer there. So having updated resources for families is hugely beneficial. And none of us has either the time or the expertise to keep that updated ourselves. Mm -hmm. It seems that there was much greater follow through with people that at least got introduced to the behavioral health specialist. Um, a lot of times it's just parents either don't have the time or people in their heart of hearts don't really believe that it will be helpful and just having the specialist come in and speak with them, uh, there was a lot of relief um, and people were more likely to follow through. Of course everyone knows time is a big issue in pediatrics. You want to see uh, people in a timely manner and usually visits are 15 to 20 minutes and it's very easy with a complicated behavioral topic to get caught up and spend 15, 20, 30, 40 minutes and you haven't even gotten to what the visit was originally <laughs> uh, designed to cover. And so having a behavioral health specialist allowed you to offload some of those issues or at least to be delved further into by the specialist rather than you who are, is under a lot of time constraints with other people waiting to see you. It has been a great success. We have seen outstanding outcomes, patient satisfaction rates, but more so than anything, it adds an additional um, opportunity um, for these students to really get their needs met. I just hope that we continue, we are able to continue with this uh, program. Uh, it's really added a great benefit to our, all of our teen health centers. It's been awesome. Integrated healthcare to me means that our kiddos are patients here can get all of their care from here or a lot of their care from here. I truly believe that having the integrated behavioral health specialist is a very necessary part of a large office that we have with so many people with so many needs. The future of integrated health. I would love this to be in every pediatric office there is. Definitely. If you're ready to bring integrated health care to your clinic, please call the Office of Integrated Health Care at Starfish Family Services. <laughs>